Hello, it's Greg Harrelson here with Century 21, the Harrelson Group in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. And I just wanted to share some information with you, give you an update on what's been going on in the Grand Dunes real estate market so far this year. It's been a great year. There's been a lot of activity. If you've been in the community re recently, drove around, you can see a lot of building going on. So there's a lot of action, but I wanted to share the numbers with you so you can kind of get an idea of what's really going on behind the scenes. It doesn't really matter if you're thinking about buying or selling. I just think it's always a good idea to check in with your real estate investment and get an idea of what's going on. My goal is for you as a Grand Dunes property owner to be amongst the most informed property owners along the entire Grand Strand. So let me just get right into the uh, the numbers, share with you what's going on, and then you can just go on to your uh, to, with your day and just have a, a great holiday season. You know, right now there's 110 listings on the market in the Grand Dunes. So this is amongst all of the Grand Dunes communities. Right now there's 110 properties listed for sale. Out of those 110 properties, 63 of those properties are resales and 47 um, of those properties are either to be built or new construction that's already somewhere in the process of being built. So there's 110 properties for sale, 47 new construction, and 63 are resales. From a sales standpoint, there's actually been 70 sales to take place this year and 35 of those sales were new construction and 35 of, of those sales were actually resale. So half of the properties that are selling are resales and half of the properties that are selling are new construction. You know, for those that are, are currently or thinking about selling a property right now, we have to, I'm talking about new construction and resales in the same conversation because they are competitive products right now in the community. As you can see, half of the buyers are buying new and half of the buyers are buying resales. So it's very important to know. Uh, uh, right now there was 148 new listings to come on the market throughout the year. 70 of them sold. So approximately 47% of the properties that are being listed are selling. So that's less than half of the properties that are being listed are actually getting sold within the same calendar year. Now I have my opinions on that as sure everyone will have an opinion, but in my opinion, what needs to be done right now if you're trying to sell a resale in the community is the property has to be marketed aggressively. Typically builders, developers are, are putting um, a lot of advertising dollars and a lot of marketing in play to try to sell their new construction. And I think that's paying off for them and they're drawing a lot of buyers in that direction. And that's no problem. That's what they should be doing. Yet at the same token, if you're wanting to sell a resale, you need an agent that's going to have some similar marketing strategies as that. So let me know if I can ever help you with that type of information. I'll share with you some ideas on what needs to be done. To continue on though, right now, the um, average list to sales price. So when a property comes on the market and it finally sells and there's a negotiation going on, right now in Grand Dunes, the average list price to final closing price is 96%. So the negotiation is um, usually um, amounting to a approximately 4% decrease from the list in price all the way down to when it finally closes. So about a 96% list to sales price. It's taking on average 212 days to sell a property. So it's not taking all year like it, uh, like it seems like, um, you know, that there's a lot of properties sitting on the market, but there are some of the properties that are current listing uh, that have been on the market well over six months right now, and they're not under contract. So we're starting to see that some of the listings are staying on longer for the, but for the properties that are priced correctly and marketed aggressively, on average, it's only taken 212 days. Unfortunately, the next statistic is one that I think, uh, you know, we would all want to be uh, a, a little bit better than it is, but, you know, I have to report it, and that is 14.8% of all the properties that are being listed in the Grand Dunes are failing to sell. They're falling off the market. And again, I will give you my opinion. If those things are marketed more aggressively, that probably wouldn't happen. So that's the numbers. That's what uh, we're seeing right now in the Grand Dunes. There's a lot of activity. I anticipate the activity to continue to be fairly strong. We'll see what happens when the interest rates adjust. And if that has an impact on our, on our real estate market, that is kind of to be determined. A lot of banks think that we may slow down a little bit, but again, that's just uh, speculation. So we have no indication that that's going to be true. Um, if you are thinking about selling, I'd love to talk with you. My name's Greg Harrelson with Century 21, and one of my strengths is marketing, and my next strength is communication. So I will communicate with you as to what's going on, and I'll make sure your, mar your property
property is marketed more aggressively than your competitors. So give me a call. That's Greg Harrelson. I hope you have a wonderful holiday season. Talk to you soon.